What's going on today? Squirrels? Is it a squirrel day? No, it's not a squirrel day. <sighs> Dog. No, go ahead. All right. I'm Pot Roast. I'm Benjamin. We're back alley bastards. And here we are leaving St. Louis. We're going past the iconic Bush, Anheuser Busch, or InBev, whatever you want to call it these days, brewery. Uh, it's a hazy day, a warm day here in the Gateway City. Uh, it's good to be on the road. I'm hoping we get back in one piece. That's fan included. I know you're not seeing the brewery, but there it is, right there, the beautiful Anheuser-Busch Incorporated, home of the Clydesdales. Louder than hell in here because we have to have the windows down as we don't have air conditioning. And here in a moment, we will see the arch. And if you live in St. Louis, it's, hey, there's the arch, which is what everybody does when they see the arch. I honestly have no idea where we're heading. I think Decatur somewhere. Pot Roast has figured all this out. Kind of talked me into this whole mess, but I'm excited to be going. I, I really am. And couldn't really travel anywhere this year, which sucks. But at least we get out today. we go across the bridge I'll uh, set it up and just let it record maybe we should try time-lapse uh, yeah if you can get it figure out how to do the time-lapse I think I can uh, I know it does it because running down the road we don't. two hours and 45 minutes basically. yeah To get that thing set up. Yeah, stick it in the glass. You think? We'll be stopping shortly up here past these same lights. The tugs are out doing their job. I guess you could call it a tuck job. Put up bump. This week on Back Alley Bastards, Gambler. By the way, we're dressed as choir members because what else would bastards dress as? We were sent to the church orphanage. Now we're forced to sing in the choir. No. That's exactly where we're slid. Want to do a couple pans? Yeah. <laughs> Pan a bowl, whatever it takes. Pan a bowl. This thing. It's got a mind of its own. Yeah, there it goes. I recentered it. Wait. 
waiting for y'all to curse us. Right? just crossed our first water crossing it's uh well I wouldn't worry too much about the danger of drowning or being swept off the road but what a day we have in beautiful Illinois we're here with all these other gamblers who showed up and we're slowly making our way down some dirt roads I say we're not gonna hit anything too technical today so that's good I don't know what this van will take. Now I'm gonna roll down my window. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, we're working on getting the coordinates now. So here we're trying to get some wheels to be on. Tap it up. So here we are after our first water crossing and filming out the window so you can see the beautiful fall colors. And uh Hope I don't drop the camera. We got our CB working, which is kind of nice. I haven't really ever used one of these, so you never 
know who the hell they're talking to. I, mean, I guess we need to assign call handles to everybody. And, uh, no. I just realized all you heard was uh, the sound of air moving. So, uh, sorry about that. I'll do better. Yes. Oh, yeah. All right. We're trying our first major water crossing, but hell, we have a free van. I mean, how bad could it be? Oh, boy. I think my feet might get wet. You ready for this? Uh, sure. Right. Can we stick the thing out the window? Uh, get a better view. You're going to get wet. All right. All right, here we go. Whoa! Yeah. That's 10 floor slamming in the back of the TV. See, they came in through the back. More water in this one. Yeah, it's a little deep. <laughs> it's a little deep. It's in the car. Let's go up, turn around, we'll follow these guys to the next one. Oh, damn, There's a turnaround spot right here. It's a little deep. So here we are at the airplane crash site. And uh, I think this is our third checkpoint. And I don't know much about airplanes, but I don't think that airplane was ever going to fly. I think it's a tractor. I think they've lied to us. They, they took the wings off of it. Yeah. Get this thing to recenter. That is the worst airplane ever. What happened here? I don't know. World War II lost lives in. Huh. There's the marker, the old steel wheel. There was one of these on the farm next to me. They wouldn't let them on the road. They would eat the road up terribly. I always thought these things were super cool. And when you think of tourist attractions in Illinois, you immediately think of the center of Illinois. And here we are at the exact center of Illinois. That's fine. Flip it back around. There it is in all its beauty and grandeur. Wow. They say Illinois is born state. I can't believe that. We've got quite a convoy running through here. Got some excellent vehicles: the Slimer, the Horny Tracker, the Ghostbuster, Fan the Cruiser. Oh crap! Looks like everybody's leaving on us, and we got to keep going because the vehicles uh, don't have exactly the best. Uh... As I was saying, the vehicles don't have exactly the best speedometers and. Uh, I think we're the slow man on this totem pole. I don't like that crunch in the front suspension. Yeah. The crunch, the chunk. So it's harvest time, so we're running across a lot of grain trucks coming into these uh, silos. So that kind of slows us down a little bit. And, uh, as you can see, we've got a whole line of cars here. It's like somebody's having some trouble up in the front. It's a lot of fun. I'm really enjoying the gambler. I didn't think I would actually. 